Hello guys, today I'm gonna show you how to unlock Google account, also called Herpy Lock, on Samsung Galaxy S24 S921B model using EDGTA box. So, as you can see from this message and this icon, our phone Herpy Lock, it, we have Android 15 on board. Let's read info from phone. We see here that we have Android 15 and Beat 5 with higher firmware version. That means that uh, you port closed. We cannot service this phone via USB port. And we have only one sol solution for this. Solder directly to memory lines and erase persistent partition directly via GTA box. So we will use this ICP pinout. It's similar to S24 Plus. You can see RX appearing on points here. Let me, let me zoom. And TX appear TX on. They placed between CPU and memory. So let's do this. So, guys, soldering completed. You can see four wires soldered to pins. Also, I am cut it apart of protection for better access to pins. So <coughs> what we have here subboard connected to motherboard socket solder to ICP pins box connected also we have power from PC so let's test our connection now Let's run Dita Plus. I will not read info from phone because it acts in a based phone and connection not stable. We will do all cl quickly. Erase persistent and after this also erase user data and cache partitions. So choose the ACP. Written phone ticked. Let's press connect. <clears throat> Partition table, read it. So let's switch to Samsung vendor and press actions and remove your button. Persistent erase. Now let's erase one by one cache. And after this use the data. We don't need to erase full partition, just need to erase a couple of data because erasing all partition will take many time. When we see a progress bar, we can stop the process and then stopping takes a time, don't worry, and then let's erase user data. Yeah, we see that process started. Let's stop it. And maybe let's try to read info, but I think it will be not read it because connection will be lost during reading. But anyway, let's try to do this. Currently, connection not lost it. That's good. Hope software will be able to read info, but it can be lost it in any moment.
the grip in VFS takes time. Next partitions and mounting will be faster. Means mounting, sorry. left a little bit and final step connect collecting device information and we see here April patch with Android 15 on board so as I told before you look closed now we can disorder wires let's do this and after this we will check is it done or no let's disconnect power first and disconnect the box. And left GND wire. I will clean where I'm soldering it later. Currently we just will check is it done or no. So let's put my board back. bit hot I hope I will complete this okay now so let's connect to CD let's connect 5G antenna and let's connect battery finally and then let's try to run our phone Yep, we see logo, it's very good. Now phone will boot to recovery because as I told many times when we are racing partition the cloud file system not created, we need to make reset through recovery to create the cloud file system. And after this, it will boot it. It will boot like a charm. So system started, let's complete setup. We see that VRP icon disappeared now. And now we will have working option for skip network connection. Let's quickly finish it. Next, next, next. home and let's check again firmware version in phone 
installed in this form. About phone software information and we see also Android 15. Press like if you like this video, follow the channel and if somebody needs remote unlocks like user locks, VRP or network locks, you can always inbox me with number in video description. See you later guys.